What's going on everyone, it's your Rifle here, and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how to take out the final boss in the Prison of Elders, also known as Skull Ass, very quickly. And yes, I really said that. If you could, before I get started with this sexy time, like and or share the video if you're feeling really generous. It's much appreciated by me, I appreciate the support. But let's get this started. So all you're going to have to need is the Yalahorn, Galahorn, Jellyhorn, whatever the heck you want to call this amazing freaking rocket launcher, and also a solar secondary, preferably a shotgun. Anyways, you're also going to want to make sure you have heavy ammo synthesis. You are able to kill Skullless before the trip mines even activate. And how you do that, it's very simple actually. As you guys saw at the very beginning, we ran to this side and took out the servitor that was here and then immediately started unloading on Skullless. And by unloading, I mean unload your freaking jelly horn at Skullless as much as freaking possible. Who cares who gets poisoned? Just keep shooting at Skullless. You should be able to kill them right around when the trip mines spawn. Yes, it's that simple. All you have to pretty much do is just spam attack them. You don't have to think too much for this boss fight right now. Who knows though, it could be patched in the future. He could be made stronger somehow. And once you do finally kill Skull Ass, I just said that again, you will notice all the other enemies despawn and all you have to do is take out the waves. It works kind of like Terramorphous. Level 35 Prison of Elders can be kind of tough, but once you get to this guy, it's actually pretty simple. It's probably best just try to kill this guy at the very beginning, just so you can despawn all the enemies. And the rest of it's just a breeze, because pretty much after you kill this guy, you get your loot, you get your chest. First you're just going to have to take out the waves of trip mines, which there are two waves, but you're not going to have to worry about any enemies whatsoever. They all despawned after you killed Skullus. It's freaking noise, I have to say. But yeah, I know it's a pretty simple, short, and quick guide for you guys. Hopefully this does end up helping one of you guys. I know this has been passed around the internet plenty, but not everybody keeps up on Destiny. So that's why I'm hoping one of you guys that are watching this video actually learned something new. And if you're just watching it just to watch it, well, I really do appreciate the support. And hopefully you guys enjoyed this round that I did with Skull Ass. But I'm out of here though, everyone. Good luck, everyone, with the rewards that you get from the Prison of Elders. As always, remember to stay safe and don't sleep in beat. That's very important. Peace out. Thank <laughs> you.